America International continues, and the ice dancing teams are on the ice warming up for the free dance, including Elizabeth Punselin, who won this event in 1994 along with her husband, Jared Swallow. They have won the U.S. championships four times, and they are in the lead at this point after the original dance. Bustapoli, Margaglio of Italy in second, Razova and Shimacek of the Czech Republic in third place. Representing the United States, Elizabeth Punselin and Jared Swallow. And this free dance begins with the leaders, Punselin and Swallow of the U.S. They missed their last year as eligible competitors. They would love to go back to the Olympics with a good showing and start off this Olympic year with a win near their hometown of Pontiac, Michigan. The music, a tribute to Elvis Presley. As we begin this Olympic season, this performance really holds a lot of meaning for Liz Punselin. It was in this very building in 1994 with her father watching and she and Jared won their second national championship. But then just days before making their trip to Lillehammer for the Olympics that year, his death occurred. They went on to finish 15th in Lillehammer, but would love to capture a medal this time around. help fallen in love now they picked this homage to Elvis Presley because they wanted to evoke a more romantic time when a boy and girl danced together not opposite each other not against each other but together kids these days huh and of course what represents that are these long sweeping moves the edges the emphasis on long lines and the togetherness that they show. This free dance worth 50% of the overall score. It lasts four minutes. Liz and Jared, the current leaders. Now, they have just wonderful security control their edges are so firm look at this long line that she emphasizes great turnout of the feet and of course the romanticism not at all hurt by the fact that they are happily married and finally surrender that's interesting about them is the unison that they have, the way they relate to each other, their togetherness. Even that last pose 
shows the, the emphasis they placed on line and stretch. A very elegant pair. They're really right at the top, the top rank of world ice dancers. And even if they weren't here at home, they'd get a great reception from the crowd. Liz Punselin and Jared Swallow, the leaders, shouldn't have done anything to hurt that in this program. Elizabeth Punselin back with their marks Jared in a moment. Swallow. It'll keep you on the edge of your seat. You're on ABC. Back live in Detroit, Liz Punselin and Jared Swallow, the reigning U.S. champions, expect to hold the lead over the technical merit marks. And those are fine marks. Remember, ice dancing is a very, very difficult event to judge. And when you see marks that are this high, you know that the skaters have been very good. Look at this slow motion. One of the elements that makes them so wonderful is the line that they get, the speed, the security of the edging. Look at the stretch of her body there. Even though that happens to be a low and rather dramatic position, it shows the, the, the sense of proportion and elegance that they have. First rate. And remember this, the debut in terms of the season, including the U.S. Nationals, the Worlds, the Olympics. It's an insight into what lies ahead, Dick. And these marks even higher. Here's it's a very high standard that...